Eight uh, minutes uh, past seven. That's our time on Saturday. I'm sounding good all the time. Welcome to the most happening and trending show in the land on the spot. Uh, tonight's show is the first one of the year 2023. There is much more to expect this year uh, as we host different personalities from musicians, actors, soccer stars, business people, and so forth. You know, so to um, so I want you to stay tuned. You know, to this show and expect nothing but the best of interviews. I did uh, joining me in studio tonight is a seasoned actor, film director, singer, and dancer uh, who, um, who has worked uh, on quite a number of projects uh, which has made him recognized uh, in acting industry. Uh, tonight we shall be unpacking all about the acting industry, how it started, how it has been going, um, uh, as well as uh, how uh, he views the film industry in Zimbabwe. I'm talking about uh, a two-time number winner. Uh, who won Outstanding Male Actor in 2017 as well as uh, Outstanding Director in the same year, popularly known as, uh, I mean, for, for his character uh, named Tsotsi in a popular drama series, Wenera. is uh, Zolile Makelani. Compliments of the new season, my brother. Thanks, Ola. Thank you so much for having me. It's such an honor to be the first uh, interview for 2023. 2023. And, and just to, to, uh, to put the record straight, uh -huh. Pamanama, I did not win them. Oh, you were nominated. I was nominated twice. Twice. Okay. For best actor and best director. Uh, yes, yes. yes. Wow, well, nom that nomination. You, 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 your name is Sindo. Uh, you know, Tower, you're doing something correct. You're doing something right. Yes. Okay. Yes. I'm excited to have you on this show tonight as our guest for, uh, uh, I mean, the first guest as well. Yeah, Sector Rogoya, 2023. How many? It means a lot, right? <laughs> it means a lot. It means the year is bright. The year is bright. Very, very bright. Nice one. And you're born Zolile Makeleni, uh, born in Zambia, but moved to Air, moved to Air in Harare. We want to briefly um, talk about your background mm -hmm. uh, for the benefits of your fans. Um, uh, your father is uh, South African and your mother is Zambian. Mm -hmm. How did you end up in Zimbabwe? Well, that's a question that my dad would answer best. Oh, yeah. Remember, I'm just a child. Mm -hmm. If they tell me, <laughs> yes. Yeah. Yes. So, um, we, well, I was born in Zambia, mm -hmm. but we relocated to Zimbabwe. It should be 90, 94, 95, yeah. if I'm not mistaken. Mm -hmm. uh, that's when we relocated to, 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 to Zimbabwe. Yes. Because back then, Zimbabwe was the place to go. Yeah. And my dad knows, knew, knew better. So, mm -hmm. I wanted to know Zimbabwe. Zimbabwe. Then we ended up here. Mm -hmm. So, since then, Zimbabwe has been my home mm. yeah mm. so like, I was on board, like south africa can I, are you, are, or you are, you've never been to south africa even my sibling mm. stays in south africa and i told her when i was in trans kai you know the eastern cape oh yes uh -huh. yes yes and and zambia as well mm -hmm. half of my father's family mm -hmm. they're in zambia as well mm. so zambia is like my second home yeah uh Zimbabwe has become my home. Remember, rem <laughs> remember like what what, what, what I uh, tell people, mm -hmm. I'm Zambian by birth, yeah. South African by origin, mm -hmm. but Zimbabwean by citizen. Mm. So I take pride that the fact that I'm Zimbabwean by citizen now. So you're a proud African. I'm a proud, Dima Africans, yeah, proud yeah. Tosa <laughs> guy. <laughs> also, you, you speak Tosa? Yes, they are Tetis Tosa. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> so you speak uh, uh, quite a number of uh, languages from Tosa, Isindebele, and Bemba. You know, mm -hmm. uh, how did you come to learn these uh, uh, languages? I take that from my mother. Mm -hmm. uh, remember, um, my mom, every mother is the first person, is your first role model. Yeah, yeah. My mother can speak up to nine or ten languages. Wow. <laughs> because she used to be a cross border back oh, then. Oh, yes, yes. Yeah. Due to my early 90s. Oh, my God. Yeah. So, my, my, I, I speak Bemba mm -hmm. because um, I was born in Zambia, mm -hmm. grew up in Zambia, then relocated to Zimbabwe. Mm -hmm. So, my um, I've, I never lost that Bemba yeah. accent, mm -hmm. um, that Bemba tone or yeah. that Bemba language mm -hmm. in me. Closer, my grandfather. Uh, Shona and Dota Ray Ola, Nagato is Zizira, and Dodo is Zizira and Chenda Uchkoro. Okay. My grandfather, I'm going to policy a good Chishona. We are not Shona. Mm -hmm. Chishona, you know, better than the way. Oh, yeah. Which open a miad mang, remember your clothes. Yeah, yeah. Even even how we name our kids. Mm -hmm. We don't name our kids English names okay. or Shona names. Yes. We are not Shona. Mm -hmm. We are not English. Mm -hmm. Strictly closer. Wow. So from that, I never lost my closer. Mm, yeah. I, I understand. So you speak uh, closer at home? At home, I speak closer. Even mm -hmm. my dad, like, it's reflex. That's uh -huh. the language that we speak. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> so just, I, I mean, please, just say one line in each of the languages. G give me any line that you want me to say. Okay. Um, yeah. I thank God for 2023. Mm -hmm. uh, meaning, I can speak Ichibemba. Okay. Mm. 
Wow, that's like zili zili muro ba don't wish I could give away so. <laughs> I, 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 I give many thanks to the the mother that I have. Mm-hmm. She she's one person. She's a warrior that I've I never u- thought yeah. she was. Mm-hmm. So she uh, she's one person who's taught me to always um uh take everything that's yeah. put right in front of you, not mm-hmm. for granted. Mm-hmm. Even my, my language is there. Yeah. Uh, uh, they've made me uh, blend in so well. Yeah, yeah. Back then, Kwandiri, Kwandiri Funza, why were we in Zimbabwe? Mm. It was a disadvantage. Yeah. But the fact that I'm, I'm with a mother who can speak four or five languages, yeah. I'm in the media space. Mm-hmm. I get to a place where I do a translator. I'll give an example, like when this Mexican boxer came, we went mm. to the airport to to to, to kuno, 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 kuno Mgashira. Mm. No one could speak uh, uh, Spanish. They wanted yeah. a translator. Yeah. We struggled by airport to find a translator. <laughs> so you get it. Yeah. So I'm saying, with me speaking uh, uh, six, uh, four or five different languages, mm-hmm. um, it ca- it has come handy in my in my career as well in the mm. media space. Mm. Mm. Yeah. It is uh, the After Drive here on Star FM, and I'm talking to uh, an actor, you know, uh, film director as well, Zolile Makeleni, uh, a.k.a. So, see, we are also live on Facebook page, Stifem Facebook page right now, streaming also on my Facebook page, DJ Ola 7 Stifem uh, Facebook page. So, see, you grew up in uh, in the ghetto, in mm-hmm. Epworth. Mm-hmm. You know, how was your upbringing? Exactly. <laughs> so, um, before we relocated to Epworth, the first uh, ghetto that we stayed uh, mm-hmm. in when we relocated to Zimbabwe was in Zengeza One mm. with my with my grandfather. Okay. Remember, my mother was Diangar Mororo Tango Wamakele. So I told her, "Go check it out." Anasa Kogod always wanted was Zukuru. Yes. Being the one major reason why we had to relocate to mm. to mm. to Zimbabwe. So uh, I grew up in, uh, in 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 Zengeza. Then my parents had to buy uh, stand here in Epworth. Mm-hmm. So from Chitungu is a Randaiti ghetto. Yeah. Then I went to Epworth to the real ghetto. Right. To whereby the only light that we get is mm-hmm. through candles. Candles. Back then candles were expensive. So <laughs> uh, in Zambia, mm-hmm. you know, my koloboy. Mm-hmm. Every member person knows what a koloboy is. is mm-hmm. My light, I'm going to use a paraffin. Oh, my, 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 to, it's not my rambi. Iwa or my rambi. It's not my rambi. It's not my All right. You, you get it? Yeah. Do I have to my light? Say, mm-hmm. If you can't afford a candle, we just buy paraffin. Yeah. Because you know, you last four or five days. Yeah. Eh, so, Dava and Daniel's owner, ah, ah, who are going to get over, who's going to get on the Oku Jago Chago. So, um, I, I wasn't brought up in a very, um, uh, well up family. Yeah. And, uh, to be, to, to, to your own surprise, Ola, you, you learned, Kuti, most of the things that I've learned, I've learned the hard way. Mm. So, I've learned to appreciate life mm. as is. I've learned to go to the church and say, "I'm just sick of it. I'm 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 just sick for a reason, yeah, and I am where I am today for a reason. For a reason, yeah, you get it, yeah. And uh, trusting back, uh, Zolide, you were a member of the school uh, drama club in uh, secondary school. Mm. Uh, was that the time you discovered you were passionate about uh, acting? Trust me, I never, I never thought I would do, I would do acting as a profession. Mm. In any, I'm an outspoken person. Mm. I'm an advocate. Yeah. Kuchikoro, I would just join drama club because I just wanted a place where I can, a place where I can get audience. Yeah. I love audience. Uh-huh. Even I just want to be in a place whereby everyone is happy. Yeah. So the reason why I joined the drama club was the only place that I could run away. Me and numbers were never friends. Mm-hmm. So the best way to dodge my book is when go to a club with me. I'm going to drama. I go watch it. So in your family, are you the only one? I mean, who has uh, ventured into uh, acting? Uh, as far as I know, I'm the only one. Mm-hmm. Uh, I'm the only one. Remember, I told you to na mm-hmm. and uh, most most of my family members uh, used to to call me the the the, the junior pastor because mm-hmm. my my, my Seguru was a pastor. Yeah. they wanted me to be a pastor. Trust me, all life you see me standing in front of a pulpit uh, uh, preaching, you're like I was brought up like that. Mm-hmm. I even went to Bible school. Oh, yeah. pizza. I, 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 I say to God, I need a better pulpit. I don't mm-hmm. need to be standing in front of people to yep. minister. Mm-hmm. I, I want to use that which you have entire given me mm-hmm. to minister ma, 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 uh, your, your word. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay. And uh, now that you knew you love, uh, you loved acting, mm-hmm. did your, I mean, did you further your, uh, your study uh, for it? 
Yes, I did. Um, I wanted to. I applied for Gramofix um, for Ziftesa back then, uh, and uh, Gramofix. Then I got an exception to go to after that mm -hmm. was in 2009. Mm -hmm. But the unfortunate thing happened. I couldn't get Maria visa. Mm -hmm. I couldn't get Maria mm -hmm. what? And it really broke my heart. Was yep. this is something that I really wanted? Uh, fortunate enough, I found a college uh, back back then in the Gramophics mm -hmm. um, that trained uh, acting, directing, and producing. Mm -hmm. uh, I still remember up to now. I still owe <laughs> the college yeah. if it still exists. <laughs> My was the, the the principal then saw how passionate mm. I was. I'm thankful. I don't see Joshua Chiduza. Mm -hmm. You get it? Yeah. He took me in. Mm. He like young man. Okay, fine. We can we can we can work out a deal to yeah. buy mm -hmm. Then work uh, for us mm -hmm. to pay your your, your, your tuition. Oh, that's, yes. that's how passionate I was. That's mm. how bad mm. I really wanted to do this. Yeah. And uh, earlier on, I came across uh, you know an article <coughs> you did with an uh, online publication mm. where you stated that uh, life gave you lemons, and uh, you, you know I was forced to uh, drop out of school. Mm. Uh, it reads. Life got tough, and I eventually failed to pay my tuition fees, forcing me to drop out and just to enter the field of film with that, with just the few pointers I had acquired in school. Close cut. Mm -hmm. uh, from the statement I read, um, mm -hmm. and uh, couldn't you get uh, someone to assist you just uh, so you could uh, complete your studies? Um, Ola, if uh, I, w I want to tell you something that I've really learned from my father without him mm. uh, knowing. This is one thing that he's he will mm. hear after this interview. My father is one guy who told who, who, who would rather suffer in silence mm. than to knew and oh, mm. you get it? Yeah. That's one principle that I learned from him. Even I too. I got to a point to, to whereby I told my parents stop paying my, my, my tuition fees because mm. we are five in our family. Yeah. You, you get it. My brother was book, book A smart. Yeah. You get it. Yeah. So uh, they, they go ask us, why should they be paying my fees mm. if this guy can do better than mm. me? Mm. You get it. Mm. Not not because I I didn't want to go to school, mm -hmm. but I weighed my options and I saw to no, it's it's better off waste my resources mm -hmm. where it's where it's necessary. Yeah. I'm a I'm a guy who would hardly ask for anything from anyone. Mm. Ask the pe people that have worked with me up to today. Yeah. It's hard for me to come just say, Ola, please, can I, can, can I, can I, can I, can I, can I, as much as I would want to. Mm -hmm. I want to give credit where it's due. Yeah. I want you to feel entitled to, to help me. Mm -hmm. Not because we didn't mm. but if you Kuri don't Kuri. want, that's it. Yeah. So yeah. I've learned yeah. to, to, not to rely on anyone, mm. but to re rely mm. on myself. I have a saying that I always tell people that when they come across with it, no one cares about you in life. Do you know that? Mm -hmm. That's except, true. Except yourself. Yeah, that's very but true. But they pretend. So why should I waste energy in do, going to someone on those mm. that you buy have a phone on? So and, uh, mm. you know, back then, uh, when we, uh, when, I mean, we took out Zambiri Kwago, so to say, uh, I, I want to be a radio DJ or an actor, or I pinned a business mm. appearance, you know? So to them, Mabaza Ainzi, Anama Turo, Chavai Daguti, Tite, you know, sometimes my doctors, you know, Tungo Room, even my teachers, do Mabaza Ainzi, Aribam Soro. Those kind of professions, do Angari Ao. But um, I'm just curious, you know, uh, Tsoti, uh, when you broke the news to your parents mm. that you are pursuing, you know, acting, how did they react? I did not break the news. Mm. Remember, I'm a guy who, in, and I'm a. If I put my mind that I want to do something, mm. no matter how bad you discourage me, I would rather fail, and then mm -hmm. learn from. Uh, oh, my parents were they, they just started seeing um, me on videos, mm. uh, articles. Yeah. You get home. A parent should not a child to be dis disowned by your parents silently. Mm -hmm. They are waiting for you to say something. Oh yeah. <laughs> I'm not going to say. Yeah. But joy comes mm. when they start appreciating what you're doing. Mm. Mm. Exactly. Yeah, so yeah. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. So I saw you, you doing A, B, C, and D. Mm. Mm. Deep down, you, I, can, I can feel that he's happy mm -hmm. for me. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. I'm, I'm a person who always wants to be credited. Mm-hmm. W to be credited, to put a credit and then the end. Yeah. I'm not cry baby. Mm -hmm. And I don't, to be honest, I'm, I'm one cocky guy. 
<laughs> if you don't approve with what I'm doing, it doesn't make it wrong. <laughs> I know that someone someone somewhere is approving what mm. I'm doing. Mm. Imagine Ola, Jesu akawe ana mno waka bira, ana mno waka kureta, we still crucified mm. him. So who am I to think I'm perfect to reach a convince on Vesa? So you will if you don't, you don't disagree. Yeah. That's that's your own funeral, not mine. And uh, yeah, just to remind our listeners that we are talking to Tso Tsi, you know, uh, wa shinji mnumu zi hapa, pa wenera, pa TV, achibuda jita ma, ma drama, nitika ma swap, agasiana zira ba, um, iba baba. We are live on Star FM Face, Facebook page right now you can go check us out right now and uh, you featured um, uh, in over 10 uh, projects uh, to debt uh, the likes of uh, Cook Off, Macomborero, a short film which was uh, the first project you worked on uh, in 2010. Uh, you've also featured in Bachi, Tandis, Diary, Revelation and uh, the popular drama series Wenera, which project, um, I mean, I don't think about which project you know what you guy and they get a breakthrough. For me, I will go with uh, Wenera mm -hmm. because my first project was Macomborero. Back then, I was skinny and I decided to go a tricky road. I said, <laughs> uh, Macomborero. Then there is a guy called Eddie Sandfollow, mm -hmm. identified me, mm -hmm. recognized me from that, and he introduced me to Edin Lovu, mm -hmm. who became my boss for seven years. Mm -hmm. uh, then I started working on Wenera. Wenera for me was like the 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 the. Amplify everything, everything. That, that I am today. Mm. It's because of Wenera, and I mm -hmm. owe it to to to, to that project. Mm -hmm. Because it's after that project, then I started working on all these other projects. Oh, wow! Yeah. And uh, you played the character at Sorty, but uh, initially you were working behind the scenes, mm. doing sound and lighting. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, how did you get the role of Sorty? So the funny story is, I re remember, uh, like I told you from my background, mm. I was they found out about Epa's name, so I'm going to find out Tonas, and I was going to I was the first guy on rehearsal, but remember, I couldn't fit in, mm -hmm. uh, you get it? Yeah. I was salad, I was prominent actors, mm. Mm. Chichi, and I was like, who's this guy? Mm. The royal thoughts in Wenera was not created, mm. you get it? Yeah. The royal thoughts, it was by default, you get it? The, yeah. the director uh, himself, the back then, I didn't love who, I don't boy can any and he confessed good. Mm. I don't go mirror out in the same funnel because <laughs> probably enjoy the first one Pamari. Yes, mm. you're the last one, uh, last one quaint. Mm. Per set, I was hands on. Remember, I would go to the other one. I was passionate about what I would do. Yeah, per set, I'll be hands on mm. because now Panama Ruta Sanda. No, I'm telling that Blazang Doro was out. We get Robert John's Robert Tone. Doctor Blazang the Consagro Alai Rova. I did almost everything from set designing, mm -hmm. from uh, being a cinematographer, from doing sound. Not because I was uh, I was good at it, mm -hmm. but I was someone who was willing to learn, and yeah. I want I, that's yeah. something that I really wanted to do. Mm. The Roya when the script was written, apana Roya Daniel Kumal, but because of my <laughs> face, <laughs> because of my face, mm. uh, back then in Nekusha, I wanted to share things, and I wanted to get away from my face. You get it? 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 The role of Totsi. Mm. Were you ready for it? Uh, can I talk about it just uh, maybe for a trial and error? Kwataka Kwantaka Kurira Kwanti Tis out whenever opportunities are presented to you. But out of Tis and Nacho. For them, probably they thought they're just trying me. For me, that I'm never going to let this opportunity mm -hmm. down. But if you if you watch Wenera uh, from season one up to season eleven and mm -hmm. I uh, I would only appear less than a minute, one mm. second in every episode. Mm. But I yeah. made sure all those um, uh, thirty seconds or a minute that I'm on screen, mm. I'll give I'll give them my best. Yeah. And yeah. the and, and the character became the most popular character. For our movies, they on a screen time, five, ten minutes. And uh, let's talk about the character that's in Wenera. You know, a character that is arrogant, cunning, uh, selfish, and disrespectful. You know, does that character portray Zolila's uh, uh, personality? All right, just to uh, to 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 put the the character which was because it's no uh, it's no longer there. Oh yeah, right. Zolila, remember, is a very fun loving guy. Mm, mm. Totsi is very arrogant. There is a line between Zolile and and, and Totsi, whereby if you spend time with me, you can tell the, no 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 no. So how come you're like this? Mm. Do you see? Uh, this was I, so. I, mm. But I'm not so not so not I, I remember Dr. Rod and number Fernando A school. <laughs> yes. I learned life the hard way. Mm, you get it? Yeah. So I had I had to improve myself mm, to fit mm, in. Mm, mm. Powerful. By trying to fit in, that I know it's a fit in the Purigiza. So as much as I was trying to, to, to fit in, I was developing and improving myself. Mm. So the character Totsi became 
more than what what i expected zolile na tsotsa watu siya as ndino tenda tsotsi pa kuti akada kuti zolile aiprove life life yake wow i have heard stories of musicians who do drugs uh, before going on stage you know just to be in the mood you know uh, before they perform zolile what do you do to get in the, into the character mari pane ka ritual kana to itwa isu isu kuenera tanti ne police kuti we get paid kutamba to to your surprise in i've never drank my whole life up to today uh-huh. i don't even know how alcohol tests you get it it mm-hmm. was uh, by choice my ritual in ini i love food ndine police ekuti andi gute donate anza ndi gute donate ka jikanda kanzi kuti ndenge ndakuvuzvarirwa ndokufamba fama ndovhura goma as long as my my belly yakazara wangu i can perform shikama ngwana food nene we were like best friends <laughs> you know but many at times actors tend to struggle you know to snap out of uh, the character mm-hmm. like vanenge vachi actor and end up uh, struggling you know with depression because it's ninge zvaku munetsa kuti achidzokera to your real self you know have you experienced it before um <coughs> if i say i have experienced i will be lying mm-hmm. but let me say what i've come across it mm-hmm. the problem starts when you fail to understand that uh, that you raw mm. as an actor yeah. and to separate it from your personal life remember ku, ku actor ku graft yeah. no, na security guard mm-hmm. how is security guard kumba kwako ogare pa do kumba kwako unono gara pa do kubas the moment you you know when to draw the line yeah you want to take that character with you home you know zoita vanwa ya under depression is living a life to please people mm. because remember this character in ngeka pfeke zvo zvikanzi tsotsi kana kuti uri mbinga pa 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 tv to pfekedza kati tokupa zvese hembe dzino dura tokupa mota ino dura but that's not real, real life man real life of wenda kudhen hey. so if you fail to draw that line and mm. to understand mm. that mm. that's where the problem comes i think i'm a one yeah <laughs> and let's say you get a character of playing the role of a, a lover boy mm. and there's a scene you know that you get intimate mm. uh, with someone amuzo pezi re maku nana nerene munhu wachi sometimes i i perspective ine va ine vano vakawanda but yes. if you work with professionals you know mm-hmm. we humans kubasa zvafana ne kubasa ngapo i sign assignment yako auita kuti kudhen nongoita assignment yako yopera zvamaka okay. kuzoita offset mm-hmm. hazvina concern yangu ni sa director ndine nazvo do you get it exactly yeah. and uh, your real life partner tinashe pundo who played the character gugu uh, in uh, in wenera amuna kunge ma makecha ma feelings iri pa zvinhu zvibasa you know <laughs> but my do, do you know the funny story is people think i met uh, my wife yeah. uh, tinashe mm-hmm. on set yeah tinashe would come on set to wait for me oh, remember okay. i was now directing mm-hmm. sandina is opetsera kubva pa set so in, in in me trying to be a sweet guy mm. i consulted with my producer kuti wangu kati kutsagira ka roga roga da bin ke kuti afana kuita say kuvaraidzwa nengo vasa boyekana nekuti mirira i i i dated my 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 now wife yeah. for 11 years 11 years uh, people don't know that 11 yes that was on my place and I'm blazing me like perfect because I start, I fell in love with her when she was just 9 10 9 yes and I had to wait till she was 16 and I asked her out and I had to wait to <sighs> she to till she was 18 for her to say yes wow yeah <laughs> <laughs> then vamos vamos para den after she said yes then we dated for all those years hey so it's a it's a, it's a genuine to where by people don't know mm-hmm. and it's it's not in the public domain to know it really. yeah, yeah 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 and uh, of all the drama series and films uh, uh, that you have worked on you know which one was your favorite and why uh, when uh, I, i'm biased i always say whenera mm-hmm. was i worked uh, whenera became a baby whenera became a part of my life mm-hmm. whenera became i uh, became a part of my life mm-hmm. i can say that because i worked uh, when uh, nearly five to six years yeah uh, and it was heartbreaking when i left because it's something that i thought you know what mm. this is this is the project that god has given me I'm why why what does it here growth is inevitable it's uh, sometimes <laughs> and uh to be to be to be honest uh, there are times to where by you feel like i've been on this camp for mm-hmm. too long yeah. and um mukurarama ana someone ano donzera someone ano donzera someone ano donzera but i i had to come to a point where by i said you know what uh, as much as i love this baby it, it was it was a very heartbreaking decision to yep. to to me mm. because i really loved when it was mm. one thing that has made the rest of zimbabwe know who zoli lemakeni yeah, is yeah. but i had to say you know what i have to say goodbye mm. yeah okay tell us about your best and worst time on set my my worst uh times on set was to to direct mm-hmm. and see my wife being hit oh yeah and i have to make sure that i get the best clip saka nambama isina unyazorova tunaita retake Hey, the raw food. You get it? And she's 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 giving you that look, dude. 
Because as a director, remember, mm, mm, uh, mm. Uh, on whenever I would wear uh, three caps, I would direct, I was the cinematographer, mm-hmm. and I would act. Mm-hmm. So, when I would direct, I passed out the show. So, it's in that boss. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I remember the scene we did na na Tanyaradzwa, Fatima, Makunganya, and she. And to her, she whispered in my ear, I'm going to be able But I'm like, She's my wife, but okay, Zemura, <laughs> you, you get it? I was in between. But yeah, even, even, even her, she, she, she felt sorry after yeah. Tapeza, she mm, had to go say, mm, I'm sorry. Mm, but I don't know how to was two, three days. But I, 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 uh, with professionals, mm-hmm. I'm I'm talking of professional actors, people who really know what they're doing yeah. on set and what mm-hmm. they uh, could what acting is. Pano toro wa munu kanafana unga chiroa. You get it? Yeah. Afana ukecha okay, mafile, zuto nzika, takato no seka, pape, takato no next scene, takato prepa for next scene. Kwa <laughs> wano chikecha my feelings, you're mm-hmm. in the wrong field. Kata mm-hmm. kuno itakana wait. Asisi zaako. Asisi zaako. Uh, in all that you do, Zalile, uh, what drives you? You know, and uh, who or what inspires you? Um... I'm a student of the game. I'm inspired by ev- my day-to-day life. Mm-hmm. But there's one thing that keeps me grounded um, is my Christian background. Um, I thank God I was brought up in a setup that I was brought up into. There are things mm-hmm. and th- that up to now, I didn't see Kuningas Nebasa back then, but yeah. now they really make sense, especially mm-hmm. with the kind of job that I do. Yeah. That grounds me. Every day, I look forward to doing something better Kupura mm-hmm. Randagachita last, yeah. last time. Yeah. Hence, I had to leave uh, uh era. but I want to improve every day of my life. Uh, I had a policy of the eighty three percent after I'm done and mm-hmm. everyone else is happy would go and rewatch Satan Taita. Mm-hmm. If I'm not satisfied, I would tell myself why do how do then do I think would even watch Nakir in Kan and Silunak? Yeah. So can I need Silunak would Mark said that all the executive producer mm-hmm. the eyes got that Yeah. Let's redo. So I'm, I'm, I'm a guy who likes to see growth each mm-hmm. and every day mm-hmm. of our life. Mm-hmm. If I work with you today or like if I see you with um, Pa, pa level two mm-hmm. tomorrow if i see you all i'm expecting to see you by level 2.8 yeah exactly, exactly. Quite a level two still mm-hmm. you get it so uh i'm, I'm a guy who likes to be, like loves to be surrounded with people who are way way ahead mm-hmm. of me so that i learn every day and you look at them you're like i'm not even there yet mm-hmm. so if i remain if i oh uh, if i invest my time goes square and then mm-hmm. go to many mm-hmm. So I'd rather be in a place whereby I feel like I'm a small fish in a tank yeah. but never surround one of my sharks. That's so better. here is a statement uh, you once said. <laughs> um, he said, I couldn't face a rejection simply because of uh, where I come from. Mm-hmm. I haven't, uh, I, I have learned uh, the hard way uh, to prove that uh, it's not where you come from but where you are going. Close quote. Please explain further, Zolili. Um, the problem that we have, society is a blanket. Yeah, I know Fuki Zanayovan. Mm. To understand that you are in a certain place, there are certain things that you can't do. Mm-hmm. Our, the reason why you ask that, I always tell, say this, and I make sure that I always say this. Mm-hmm. After my high school, I went, I, 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 I did radio. Radio was my first. I fell in love with media through mm-hmm. radio. Yeah. I did uh, a diploma in radio broadcasting and producing mm-hmm. and everything. I went for an interview mm-hmm. at a certain radio station back then, 2012, mm-hmm. uh, just before we were Yeah. My paperwork was on point. Yeah. Mm-hmm. managers. I was told because break because of my background. Yeah. I was told Guti, my English is too ghetto. Mm-hmm. This type of radio station in it van I could try to reach out. As blunt as he was, hey. I was heartbroken, but I improved myself from that day on mm-hmm. because I was trying to prove him wrong. Yeah. You get it? But yeah. I have to benefit and mm-hmm. I learned because I wanted to prove someone wrong. Mm-hmm. So if your background <laughs> defines who you are, yeah. you're doing yourself dis- mm-hmm. uh, disservice. Yeah. No matter what uh, you Jesus was born in a manger. Mm-hmm. You get it? Yeah. That should not define who, who you are. 
it's what you want in your life you always remember that the only person who cares about you is yourself mm. if you don't see yourself beyond the place that you're in if you don't see yourself beyond being kwepo then mm. that's you and uh, did you ever uh, imagine that one day you shall become a household name in zimbabwe never Never, never. I have imagined that. Uh, for, for for me, they don't be surprised. Apparently, you know, like the Zulu, we should come and do it. It's like ah, we are. Don't be. We must have got. Got exactly. But uh, you know, uh, to what extent did your upbringing contribute uh, to your career? It did. Acting uh, career, by the way. My upbringing uh, contributed to my acting career because um, Kugeto, Kuneva, and Wari, when they're full of humor, mm -hmm. you get it. We, we we find fun in eating em one meal pass. Yeah. Um, I mean, we're comfortable with it. Mm -hmm. Being raised in a place like that, yeah, I vura. The name we dark humor. And those some boys, I And I ask myself, where is this coming from? Mm -hmm. It's because of my upbringing. Mm -hmm. Do you know, there are certain um uh to to my games or to my time I dara the the kuma ghetto to my town. It's a lesson that it was uh, teaching me. You know, I can fit in any place, Ola, mm -hmm. right now. Yeah, yeah. Raised in a ghetto has made me to become a chameleon. Mm -hmm. There's no place right now I feel I can't fit mm -hmm. in. And uh, what are some of the challenges that um, are accompanied by, uh, I mean, your profession? Um, my profession needs people to understand the professional side of art. Mm. So I thank you, what about my profession. Kuna was only acting as a profession. Mm -hmm. The moment you see it as a profession means there are certain qualifications that you need. Mm. Even grooming and etiquette role, mm -hmm. uh, all. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. Do, do, do you get what yeah, I'm talking about? Yeah, I get it. Those, those certain things, how you handle yourself, mm -hmm. do, do you get it? Yeah. Okay, fine. One audience, mm. million of people follow you. What are you going to say next? Mm. Do you get it? You start investing in yourself because you know the place that you're going to be. Mm -hmm. one, it, it's a recipe for disaster. You, you get it? Yeah. Because you are one audience, one attention, you're good to, you don't know what to do about mm, it. Mm, a microphone mm. is very good, mm -hmm. but in a person who really knows what they're doing. Exactly. With it. Same as a femme. Mm -hmm. Femme is like poison. It's like a drug. Well administered by a doctor, it's very good. Fail to administer it well, it becomes toxic. Mm. Those are a femme. So yeah. you need to have self-development. Understand what you want to graft. Hey, and uh, uh, I, I would want to, you know, hear from you, uh, Tsotsukuti, what are some of the benefits that, um, I mean, that come with your uh, profession? The benefits that come with, profession, with the, this kind of profession that I mean, you get to knock doors that no one can knock. Mm. I keep telling people, who do you think is in a better position of rebranding Zimbabwe? A politician or an artist? Mm -hmm. An artist, you know why? Because an artist are uh, a partisan. Mm -hmm. Right now, I can walk into anyone's office. Mm. The moment I knock, than to, uh, to 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 knock in a door, then you introduce yourself. That don't all under that two more and agree. The moment I walk into a certain door, but this time I'm talking the environment is tenseness. I'm talking about what I'm talking myself. Don't just say no. Garden of Peter, my God, thank God, thank you, Jesus. I'm here. I'm <laughs> picture point young. Mm -hmm. So the benefits that comes with the, with that is when you position yourself mm -hmm. and understand what you. Now this is a brand that I need to protect. Great. And from the time you, uh, from from the time that you you have been in the film industry, uh, would you say you have uh, accomplished uh, what you have always wanted to achieve? I've accomplished more than what I've uh, uh, dreamt out of achieve. Mm, mm. You get it? Yeah. I, I I dine with ministers. I dine with business people. Mm -hmm. I, I've flown out of Zimbabwe. I don't even know how many times. Mm. I never dreamt of that. You, you get it? Yeah, Just that you to move no humble and these types no tour myself in the tango you have to know and I end up by airport. Sorry, Rabu. That's a little. So, um, in terms of uh, investments, mm -hmm. uh, like, you know, I'm achieving the in terms of, uh, uh, you know, investments uh, or some of my life. What part of my life? Right. Uh, that's a question that I would answer and uh, I want it to be a lesson to people who are listening and mm -hmm. who are watching. Yeah. Uh, the the danger with the type of job that we do, fame mm -hmm. is like a rain season, Baba. Yes. Pa unofu ngoto kuchara mbaku chinaya, wabata. Whatever you are paid, go reno ya koto ita drought. And unofu ngoto ndo kuchara mbaku chipisa mangwana kunemu na nanga ito pisa kufura iwe. So you have to make hay whilst the sun still shines. Mm -hmm. Um, I would say I regret knowing things late. I regret uh, um, not understanding the power and the value that I had mm -hmm. as a person late. I regret uh, uh, letting fame get into my head. Yeah. You get it? Um, I could have achieved more than I dreamt of. I let opportunities pass me by. Mm. You, you get it? Don't yeah. fly on the zoo. What's the zoo? 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 What's the z
Yeah. Rent to to da Maria rent guy. You get it? Mm-hmm. I I had, I had deals to whereby I could have I could have bargained yeah. and I could be somewhere else. Mm. So I'm saying this to uh, to someone who's right now who's in a position that So I you're think, you're actually regretting. I'm 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 regretting, mm-hmm. but I'm not regretting. Mm. I thank God. Remember I said I learned life the hard way. Mm-hmm. Probably this was my my my, my form of of, of learning yeah. it, it was a learning curve to me and i thank god but it's never too late mm. and ri- right now trust me all language and dr amazon ya to say and dr doctor dr ja na grona mas eu fui dr eu dr out go anywhere as mm. long as you want me there i'll be mm. there mas mm. vana I, i don't do that yeah. i have to ask wha- what's in it for me mm. and how far does it go yeah. and, and not only money <laughs> because remember ola let me tell you one thing that the corporate understands mm. the corporate understands the value that we artists carry mm-hmm. but it's so we don't yeah, so the problem is yema corporate tis ma Them. And, But, yeah. yeah, but uh, looking at the Zimbabweans, uh, you know, film industry, how do you read it? Uh, you have? We don't have an industry, Ola. Mm-hmm. I'm sorry to say this. We don't have an industry. We have a community. Mm. It's only going to be an, an industry when you put um, legislation rules da, uh, ba, on the paper. Mm-hmm. It's only going to be an industry. Tika, 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 um, uh, how, 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 how can I say it? Formalize mm-hmm. our, uh, our, our industry. Right now the government is losing a lot of GDP mm. that it could have earned from from uh, from the film sector. Yeah. Because at Tina uh, uh, uh legislation um rule uh, uh bylaws mm. z- 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 no protect our interest and and the state's interest. Yeah. So I'm saying right now Ukanzo, I, we don't have an industry mm-hmm. and I'm very very grateful to people who are trying to do something people like me mm-hmm. to make this community alive. And uh, can you point out uh, you know, what needs to be done in order to do better and even you know break in beyond uh, our borders? We need to put face structures down all mm-hmm. to understand what this is a job mm-hmm. a paying job that can earn you money and me money and the nation money mm-hmm. the moment you start putting structures down like that i'm mm. i'm thankful right now there's a there's a, um, a um, an initiative uh, that, that's on the pipeline there's a film uh, whatever structure that's being put mm-hmm. on within the government yeah and the players that's the right step that we are taking yeah because i i tell you all uh, even ip intellectual property mm. no zimbabwean artists understand this from musicians to artists mm. you get it mm. you do a commercial for a, for a certain for, for for a certain company they pay you 500 dollars mm. but they use that jingle for the next 10 years yeah your 500 dollars to hey. so you tell them i'm going to do this jingle for the next five months mm. after that there's no that mm. but remember all under five why i'm going to buy a pass for the next 20 years hey. we have certain ca- faces that we see on certain billboards mm-hmm. but every year if this company is rebranding one on hey. so the problem is not it's not it's not us it's the, the fact that we don't understand mm. the value that we carry as art as artists are powerful uh, people in the public eye especially the celebrities you know a big musician socialized influencers they go to extremes you know just to get relevance uh to turn now i won't uh, you know, mention names uh but uh, my question is have you ever done something you know for cloud chasing uh let me tell you one thing i i i refrained to be to to be classified in so-called influencers mm-hmm. Pe- people who just get uh credit for things they've never done mm. we need to give credit where it's due those people are not influencers you're giving them a wrong name mm. they're not what are they influencing and who are they influencing <laughs> why why would you why would you do why would you why would you do something to to, to get attraction mm. why want attraction then what mm. Mm. Uh, do you, i i hope i'm not uh, uh if i offend you sorry but no no mm-hmm. you get it if you're just good all you don't try to yeah yeah you, you get it mm-hmm. i don't need to to be noticed if my art is that good people will notice mm. <laughs> hey. so do you think as a public figure it is a, a, a wise uh, to lie about um uh, let's say your marriage uh, relationship status or even you know uh, drag someone's name uh, just to remain relevant wangu hapana chinchi no rwadza sekunyepa i'll put it this way even kuura kuno dura because you have to maintain the lie so remember you, you should keep tabs as well kundakanyepa mm-hmm. up so i have to uh, Mm-hmm. Yeah. Why should you lie to be relevant? If you think you're good enough, just do you do, do what you're good at. Mm. Right now, if you ask them, what do you really do? What do you really sell? Mm. They can't answer that. Yeah. Yet we call them influencers. They are influencing. What are mm. they influencing? Mm. Yeah. It's just a cloud. Longo fanya season. Kuno naya magona kuno fuma kune zuba. Zato pera. Ende kana fuma tiyo ndiwaka penga stere kuno kuna kushama so magona kuno muka futi kune kamuka magana kana nika kashama. Karote dabdi zin. Sarabesi wa ma influenza. So have you ever been trolled on social media? Ah, 
for me, I wouldn't, I, 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 can't, I can't recall. Mm -hmm. Do you know that you troll away all? Do uh, mm -hmm. you know what to say? Do you get it? Mm. If you don't give people what to say, they will. Do you get it? Yeah. Remember, I told you I'm not perfect. Number one. Number two, who are you? Do you know from what you know? Do you know what I'm going to say? I'm not going to say. What do you know? I'm Remember, you go for life. Yeah, I'm going to go for life. But they have to be there. Mm. Eh, saka, why waste time on concentrating on my naysayers? They're there to, to make me go where I am. Exactly. Yeah. You you have kept and maintained your trademark mm. you know, of blonde hair mm. you know, for the past few years. Mm. Uh, what inspires it? Um, we uh, after every season would go for a refresher. Mm -hmm. We went to to buy equipment uh, in Cape Town with my um, my producer, mm -hmm. uh, executive producer. Mm -hmm. So three we were just thinking, how best can we can we rebrand? Mm -hmm. Then I was watching um, we're in um, in Centen. Then we're watching um, Idols. Mm -hmm. Then I, I I saw Somiz. I'm like, wow! What st what makes Somiz stand out is how he dresses mm -hmm. uh, despite whatever yeah how he dress <laughs> his hair is what yeah. i'm like I, I would want to do something to be weird to understand i want people to be shocked it's mm. like what do you want to do like i want to to, to put blonde in. yeah like i uh, know do that i want to do that, do that. Was it. i remember touching down uh rg international airport in my blonde team rango <laughs> two, two, two months down the line like ah, but mm -hmm. three months down the line like wow yeah. four months now it's been five years which mm. is a blonde yeah. so remember if you want to do something mm -hmm. Forget about what they say. Kopa pagono rora manja ba manja wana kufundu gere kumaro rong. Ah, ang pasha wya guys are blondies. Zuku fambasi. Wangu chando to zia mteu di blondi. Eh, chando ita uti tinya so duri si wa shaka nyani. Eh, eh. Wano zia uti ndoku nova maria wa rumayi. Right, right. Sa ini ndakato wa zandi ni munya indo ina ndega. Na wazati tezara mnoto kiziwa. Bozi mkwasha wa gara wa nongo parash. Eh, ya dena dega. Nongo parash. Nongo taura ya maria murukuda. Tone koshete. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, a dine with it. So, how different is it from the you know from other podcasts? Um, in the, one in and I remember I told you that I'm a guy who would always want to see something new mm, on the table. Yeah. Uh, when the idea dine with Sotsi came, I wanted an an an, an, an interview, um, a, a a show to whereby it's not an interview. Yeah. It's whereby people are having conversation over food. Mm -hmm. The initial idea was supposed to be uh, cooking, and we're still working on that. Cooking, you come to my place, you chill. Don't be kira ola. Can don't go to kitchen niya go bigger. Because mm -hmm. we want to break the the, the, the boring conversations to where by podcast people are just sitting. Mm. So we had to to bring in food. Remember, Doctor Regina, I love eating. So mm -hmm. I, uh, my producers and my guys like, what do you love doing most? You love eating. So let's throw in food. We talk we talk about food as much as we profile this guy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And uh, so let's see. Mm. I have received unconfirmed allegations, mm -hmm. you know, that uh, you dated your best, uh, I mean, best friends. Uh, that's uh, Patience Kuyoga and uh, Nyasha Zanga mm -hmm. at, at the same time. You impregnated one of the uh, one of them mm -hmm. and forced them to abort. How far true is that, Tzotzi? Well, like you're saying, there are allegations. Yeah. Uh, and uh, amongst the names that you mentioned, I've never dated any one of them. Mm. Yeah. How do you know them? I know them because they are familiar names and they are people that I grew up with. Mm. Yeah. But they, 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 you know, the allegation. So, are you refusing because of this? Because this uh, no, no, not, not even. In any, I keep telling people I'm an open book. Yeah. Before I dated my, remember I waited for yeah. for, for, for someone that, for someone for so that for, 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 for that long. <laughs> Before that, I am I can count the number of women that mm -hmm. I've dated. They How many are they? They are, they are less than five. <laughs> less than five, okay. Yes, that I can confirm. So these guys, I'm like, like you're saying, mm -hmm. there are people who can just do things yeah, yeah. to try and get a club. <laughs> so I'm, I'm not even bored then. <laughs> so uh, are you think these guys are maybe uh, cloud, uh, chasing cloud? No, they should get a life. Mm -hmm. Yeah. They should get a life. They should get a life. <laughs> <laughs> and that's a little for you guys. Mm. Uh, yeah, and uh, another, you know, uh, uh, unconfirmed allegation uh, said that uh, you would demand, you know, sexual favors uh, from patients, you know, in the exchange of roles in films. Do you confirm these allegations? I don't. Uh, let me tell you one thing, the good thing that I love about wh what I do. Mm -hmm. Remember I said life taught me uh, uh, the hard way. Whenever I, I have a project that I'm working on, I don't choose people. Mm. Because those is yummy, it's not a no way. way yeah. You get it? People sometimes have a team themselves. I have a team. I'm not a shikan, and don't worry, you mean don't worry, you get it? Whenever I'm, I, I, um, 
I have a panel of p- people that I work with. Mm-hmm. I don't choose people. Yeah. I'm just a director. I sit. Mm-hmm. The panel chooses. Good. I know we are not. I don't know why. Mm-hmm. You get it. To avoid it, because yeah. I've been yeah. in places yeah. to whereby yeah. you know to eat eager. Yeah, you get it. Ah, but it, you. And they, and they, I would love if anyone mm-hmm. who would, who I've worked with. I not have Zoli have asked uh, sexual favors to me. Kawe, number buru ije. Number buru ije. Number buru is a buru number. Shama i marry guy. Wana ju manya tika tazagua control up. Gaba we. Number number buru. Number is a buru. That's Zoli. So Zoli, are you still together with your wife? Yes. Um and uh, once again. I received unconfirmed allegations as well uh, from a confidential source uh, that uh, says your mother and sisters emotionally, you know, abused your wife uh, to the extent of uh, maybe you know her suffering from depression. It is alleged that uh, all this happened uh, in your face, but you did nothing about it. What do you have to say about these allegations, uh, Zolile? Uh, right. Um, that's a good question. Mm-hmm. My next project, uh, it's a project that answered things like that. Mm-hmm. We live in a society. We don't live uh, in an island. Yeah. Um, I wish I would have called uh, my uh, psychologist mm-hmm. to confirm if I can say this yeah. on radio, but yeah. now because of us, I have mm-hmm. to say that. Yeah. Do you know, you know, the PTD? Tell us about that. Post-traumatic depression. Mm-hmm. It's a medical condition that every wife suffers mm. after giving birth. Oh, yeah. But oh. my boy, mm. do you get it? Yeah. It's psychological and it's me- it's medical and my wife was treated mm. and she's okay. Mm-hmm. You get it? Mm-hmm. But all these people who are saying what they're saying, they also need help. Mm. They need help upstairs. True. Because PTD is there and it, it, it's, it's proven to be medical. Mm. Every woman who, who gives birth can yeah. confirm. Yeah. You know, the post-traumatic depression. Mm-hmm. My wife was in labor for 13 hours. 13 hours, yeah. That's because the baby time. was too big. Wow. To an extent, they had to, they had to, because she had signed when she wanted to give a natural birth. Oh, yeah. You get it, yes. but the, the baby wasn't coming out, mm. and I was in studio in Chito Shooter. Can't be a baby, but she wanted. Muna rufa na tunda mumutiye. Caesar. She didn't want that, but mm. okay, fine. Kuwa kuti ni sign what that whatever that form. Mm-hmm. The moment I walked in, leba the baby came. Oh, I'm gonna mirror the dragi. Exactly. <laughs> so because of the pain she 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 endured mm-hmm. for 13 hours, mm. it caused her to go to PTD. Oh. So upon the year, post traumatic depression causes you to start hallucinating. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh, do, do you get what I'm I, I'm from? getting uh, so this is a medical to understand the to that in some classroom to know about it you get it so and I'm I'm grateful mm-hmm. I'm grateful that I have in-laws who understand mm-hmm. me from my point of uh, and I've I have family members who helped me mm-hmm. and my my my, my in-law Tano John yeah. st- stood with me mm-hmm. up to today mm-hmm. So you saying it's not it wasn't you know is rukta wa zikunzi maybe kwa kuni you know emotional abuse. Those are not even emotional abuse. Gawa tu chake baza zira kupi emotional abuse. Gawa tu chake mabaza. Kana gawa uye tiba pe mabaza. Chowa zizi. That's not for you, you know. <laughs> so should we expect uh, uh, you in the international market this year? Um, I'm 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 thinking of expanding dine with Sotsi as far as the region. Like mm-hmm. that was my initial uh, plan. Um, one of our um, biggest partners is the biggest uh, hotel operator in, in Zimbabwe. Mm-hmm. So it's still Lyazi. Yep. Could how big uh, c- c- can we take it uh, mm-hmm. uh, around mm-hmm. the region? Mm-hmm. Yeah, uh, yeah. That's that, that's uh, it's promising. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Mm-hmm. And uh, so see, we want to wish you all the best. Uh, you know, in 2023. Thank you so much. And my hair has already started well. Uh, thank you so much for, for, for this interview. I wish we could do this every day. Every day. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well spoken as well. Mm-hmm. So how can people get in touch with you, uh, Tote? Uh, on my social media page. Oh, before that, maybe mm-hmm. you want to say something to the nation. Uh, probably you have what, uh, your parting remarks or whatever. My parting remarks are on, 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 on what I've learned through becoming a new dad. Mm-hmm. There's a reason why I became a dad at 34. Oh. It wasn't by default. Mm-hmm. You get it. Yeah. And I wish I had uh, learned this before, mm-hmm. before, or I had gone, uh, someone had, taught, uh, had um, educated me before. Mm-hmm. No one prepares you to be a father. Yeah. You get it. Mm-hmm. So do, don't impregnate when you're not mentally ready mm. to, 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 to settle. Mm. Uh, you get it. Yeah. What I went through, even the nurses who helped my wife would come. Mm. I stood with my wife for three months when she was not feeling well. I stood with my wife for three months when she was not feeling well. Yeah. On her bedside. Mm-hmm. Remember, this is my first child. Exactly. You ask, ask God, would he, why, 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 why me? Mm. No, mm. I, 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 to, to, I want to tell you, I took care of my daughter f- when she was born mm-hmm. up to today. Yeah, I would go name one or one who's scared. In any, just where did you learn this? Exactly. No one told me that. Mm-hmm. Life told me that. Wow. So I'm saying to everyone who's watching and who's listening, 
if you, li- if you let everything that you hear get into your ears, like right now, and still to tell Sana and Nanambu, or true. even my parents, true. Because I'm human, but why mom's younger ones are any why? I was on the mm-hmm. royal Nazi for 34, for 34 years. 34 years, you get yeah, it. But yeah. I, I sought for medical help. Mm-hmm. The moment I called the doctor, and I was this is what my wife is doing. I told you, and I is easy. Oh, yes, but yes, yes. I got to yes. be pregnant for nine months. Mm. Exactly. It's mental, it's, 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 it's medical. Mm. You know, the post traumatic depression, yeah. That's why I take an initiative uh, of a project that I'm working on mm-hmm. uh, with certain doctors and psychologists yeah. to educate the nation. Exactly, mood is broken right now because, because they, they sought my profit and my post. Instead of going the medical way, mm-hmm. and then meanwhile, and the doctor said you are lucky, but you you brought her here. Mm-hmm. My wife has to reco- my wife has recovered. At all, but right. My right daughter now? is one year, three months. Oh, wow, wow, right wow. now as we speak. Mm-hmm. And from the way you you, you speak, it it seems like uh, you're a happy family at home. Trust me, what you see is what you get. Mm. This energy is in studio. <laughs> <laughs> yes. This is what you get every day. Mm. Yeah. Nice one. So how can people get in touch with you, uh, Totsi? On my social media platform is just uh, Totsi. The page is there. You you say whatever you want to say. There are people who can handle that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yes. All right. Uh, thank you so much for coming, uh, Paya, on the spot. Thank you so much, Ola. I, I, I wish I could uh, stay more. <laughs> Thank, I, you I love, I love Thank you so much for giving me this opportunity to just even air out uh, yeah. things like that. Exactly, yeah. exactly. Because I don't know if you have a someone has a exposed or something like that, but you like what I'm saying, depression and, uh, you know, it's not something that needs trauma. You need mm. psychological help. Mm. Uh, it's not one, especially my, my, my public figures. I'm not talking about Wanda. You know, to say, ah, to as die, yes, as die. But sometimes it's not a platform. You could know, die, 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 die. So this is why, guys, we've created this platform for you. To say, okay, Ola, I'm coming to clear the air. People are saying this, 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 this is about me. But at least, can you give me the platform so that I can clear the air? Mm-hmm. So that, kuna mm-hmm. wano, keri aga pera, nga sikufana upera. Simply because Yes, yes, yes. So this is the platform for you guys to, to clear and the air. Thank you so much for for, 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 for giving me this platform mm. to, to clear the air and to educate the nation. Yeah. And to this is out of my bus. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. So thank you so much guys for tuning into the uh after drive and uh, you know on the sport segment, your favorite segment. Uh, tomorrow we are back again uh with Holy Ten. Yeah, you'll be telling us about uh, almost everything training on social media. Yeah, I've seen a lot. Uh, but yeah, tomorrow he will be telling us more on this program on the spot. A uh, holiday, I can't wait. Um, my name is Owen. We come around all of seven. The chief A Marshal. You can follow me on Instagram at DJ All of Seven at um, my Facebook page. My Facebook it's at DJ All of Seven Star FM, and of course, uh, the Twitter handle at DJ All underscore seven. But don't forget to follow us on the big one at Star FM Zimbabwe, and also my YouTube channel channel at dj all seven and it got a subscriber at dj all seven many thanks to the crew behind the scenes uh mike loud five mushu and the guy behind the cameras and uh madam producer nyinga today dinkana so and jago siya murumu mawoko uh yvonne tibachke achikupai chilongwa the farmers forum and then later on uh standing in for uh tilda it's leander candiero lee k the captain Kwanas, bye-bye what a hashtag extreme radio year has been for star fm we traveled all around the country and beyond moxford paragliding over table mountain and boy i can tell you this was an extreme experience